Momentum It's not the cause of success on the ice. Instead, it's the result. But hockey players know that in one small instant in time, a matter of seconds, momentum can shift in direction. The Helena Bighorns have enjoyed the momentum gained from winning every game in their schedule thus far. However, one other team in the Frontier Division has also yet to be beaten. The Gillette Wild come to Helena with their own momentum. This weekend's contests will be the first two of six regular season meetings between these dominant forces. The Bighorns fans know that after Friday night's game, only one team will sit unbeaten at the top of the division. They begin to pack the Helena Ice Arena early, hoping to get a front row seat to the game the entire league is keeping their eyes on. The fans also know that if Helena is to have any playoff success, the Wild may very well be there to try and stop them. Longtime Bighorns Hockey TV announcer Scott Keith has the call. Good evening from Montana's capital city and welcome to NA3HL Hockey here on Hockey TV. I'm Scott Keith getting ready for what is probably the most highly anticipated series of the season thus far. Two of the top teams in the Frontier Division, the Frontier front runners, and two of the top teams in all of the NA3HL meeting for the first time this season. The 21-0 Helena Bighorns facing off against the 20-0 Gillette Wild. The first period begins in a way you'd expect for two undefeated teams. Each side battling for puck possession and scoring chances. Each goaltender square to the puck and ready to make the save. Finally poked away and Bighorns with a chance of thinking hustle. Here comes Feebster in onside. Feebster with a shot club by Turek. It looked like he didn't get a handle on it. Totally feet in front shot and a save by Turek. Gets some help, Feebster loses possession. Here's a two-on-one chance for Gillette, Declan Young. Young with a shot and a save by Buchholz. Feebster picks up the loose change. Leaves it for Green. Green walking his way in front. Shot and a save by Turek. Green recovers the rebound, sends it across. It's the side of the net. Finally, it looks like it's tied up by Turek. 15.02 to play here, first period. No score between the unbeaten Gillette Wild and the undefeated Helena Bighorns. The Bighorns are used to scoring early and often in the opening period of play. But tonight would be different. Helena is now locked into war with a team that has its own designs on staying unbeaten. Land trying to hit Feebster. Too far for him. Feebster will get there, though, first behind the goal. Centering pass in front for Bland. Shot, he scores! Liam Bland on a great feed! Bighorns out in front, one to nothing! Great hustle from Sam Feebster. Sets up Liam Bland alone in the slots. Beating Jake Turk and the Bighorns take a one to nothing lead with 7-10 to play here in the first period. In the second period, the physical play begins to take shape as the checking from each team intensifies. Oh. Goaltending becomes ever more critical as the Wild and the Bighorns relentlessly take their scoring chances. Adam Harvey took a swat at it to try and break it up. Now backhanded into the Helena zone by Declan Young. Skinner back to play it. Into the corner, Bloom plays it up off the walls. Harvey taken down as he tried to bring it out. Now forcing his way through. Bloom in front for Eric. Give it a, give it a shot. It was up off the glove, I believe, of Turek. With less than five minutes left in the frame, Sam Feemster scores for Helena. Establishing that momentum is on the side of Helena. Bighorns recover. Fanny tried to make a play on it. Feemster picks it off. Here's Sam Feemster. What a shot! He scores! Sam Feemster over the shoulder of Jake Turk. And the Bighorns out in front, two to nothing. 
just under five minutes to play here in the second period. Sam Feenster made a nice steal. Just past the red line, walked in and ripped it over the shoulder of Jake Turek. Green. Across the blue line, leaving it for Feemster. Feemster nets his second goal of the game early into the third period. Gutchick recovers. Here's Tabor Gutchick walking into the high slot, tipped in by Feemster. He scores! Sam Feemster with the tip in! His second of the night! Power play goal for the Bighorns, who jump out in front three to nothing here early in the third period. The Wild continue to try to find a way to get one past goalie Eric Buckholz, who stands ready to meet each challenge. Turned over in front, Buckholz has to make a quick save there. Swings through as the defender falls down. Turk with a stop, he juggles it and holds on. As the third period draws to a close and a few of the nearly 1,600 fans in attendance begin to head to the parking lot, Helena's three-goal lead is suddenly threatened. A small instant in time, a matter of seconds. Momentum is about to take an abrupt turn. Empty net for the Wild. Minute 45 to play. Isaac Young throwing it towards the goal, went off the side of the net. Back to the point, Trebojevic down for Declan Young. Now to the corner, back to the point, Trebojevic for Sanborn. Back to Trebojevic, shot, score! In the wild, on the board, here with a minute 32 to play in the period. Lean on the far side, backhands it behind the Helena goal. Peterson tries to play it out quickly. It's Get some help from Tyler Bloom as the wild net empty once again. Trebojevic, the close wing for Young, leaves it for Declan Young in front. A Norwegian shot just misses. Minute to go in the period, score, Gillette! Somehow slipped past Buckles. I think Tucker Lean will get that one. And it's three to two with 58 seconds to play. In the midst of this turning point, Helena finds itself immersed in further adversity. A string of late penalties puts the Bighorns down by two men. The Wild now have a five on three power play. And again, Turek gets the call to the bench for an extra attacker. A game that was all but certain not 50 seconds ago is now suddenly in jeopardy, along with Helena's chance of staying unbeaten. A small instant in time, a matter of seconds, and momentum shifts yet again. The Bighorns trying to hold on for a win here to remain unbeaten, leading three to two. Empty net at the Gillette end. Trebojevic. Down in the corner, fanning on the clearing pass, now it's cleared up. goal for the Bighorns. Giving up a three-man advantage with the extra attacker on the pool goaltender for Gillette. And it looks like the Bighorns will remain unbeaten. Once again, the final score here from the Helena Ice Arena. The Helena Bighorns four, the Gillette Wild two. 
Only one team remains unbeaten in the frontier after tonight, and it's the Helena Bighorn. So we hope you'll join us for tomorrow night's game. Thanks for watching. Saturday night's contest starts with the same intensity between these two teams. In front of a sold-out crowd, the Bighorns get right back to work against the Wild. Eleven oh five left here in this first period. We are scoreless between the Helena Bighorns and the Gillette Wild. After a scoreless first period, the Bighorns come out strong in the second. Teamster comes away with it, heads to the left side. Sidesteps Fanning, dishes it in the corner, he'll chase it down, rings it around the boards. Trying to bring it in front to Watusik. Now Watusik trying to get it back to the point, he can't. Tip behind the goal, now rung around hard by Tucker Lean, kept in at the close point by Jonathan Peterson. Now to the high point for Gutchick, over for the one-timer, SCORE! Adam Harvey on a blast on the power play! Adam Harvey's one-timer! Beating Jake Turek and the Bighorns out in front, one to nothing. Buckholtz remains solid between the pipes as Gillette continues to test him. Now dished off for Adam Harvey. Here's a two-on-one chance for the Bighorns. Liam Bland and Peterson shot. He scores! Jonathan Peterson! Taking a nice feed from Adam Harvey. Black ripping it past Jake Turek. Jonathan Peterson. Taking a nice pass from Adam Harvey and ripping it past Jake Turek. Giving the Bighorns a 2-0 lead here with 3.07 to play in the second period. By the start of the third period, both teams begin to show the wear and tear of the war this weekend has been. would only muster another seven shots on goal all period. Meanwhile, Gillette looks to establish momentum on their side, scoring a goal with just less than half a period to play. Buckholtz turns aside 27 Gillette shots in this period alone. Despite their best efforts, the Wild would fall short yet again. No icing. Richards cuts it off. 15 seconds to play. Far side walking in. Fanning on the shot is young. He gets taken down. The puck goes into the close corner. Seven seconds to play. Puck is free in the circle. Now Fanning can't get a stick on it. Out to the point. Richards can't get a handle on it. The big hurts are going to sweep the Gillette Wild. And remain. The Bighorns will now turn their sights towards the NA3HL Showcase in Blaine, Minnesota, just two weeks from now. Our next episode will take you inside the three-day hockey event, where the Bighorns will face other division leaders from across the nation.